What's going on? Make sure you check out our new sponsor, Cell Phone Buyers Recyclers. They pay cash for smartphones and tablets. Like and share their social media pages, Facebook and Instagram, and website is in the description for a chance to win an iPhone. What you waiting on? Hurry up and get that iPhone. All right, real quick. Jameis Winston was on Fox News, and they took a shot at him. As Fox is known to do is have a problem with people of melanin and their skin color. Uh, let's talk about it. And Jameis had the politically correct answer. He took the high road. Hit that subscribe button, bell icon button, share the video. Check out our NBA talk playlist, NFL talk playlist, more videos like this. And basically, Jameis was on there. Um, he had just got married. And he was talking about a COVID-19 hotline that he was being a part of, promoting something positive. And then when the anchor, I don't watch Fox News, he came in there and tried to flip it. And said, I have to ask you, what do you think about, you know, Tom Brady taking your job? And Jameis, you know, handled it with class. You know, he could have walked off and said, F you. And he basically said, you still don't have a job. And how do you think about Tom Brady taking a job? He basically said he took it as a compliment that the GOAT would be replacing him in Tampa. He said that he believes in his faith. And I'll put the screenshot up here that he going to believe in his faith, believe in God and believe that he will get a job. He said he's working out from eight to 12 every day. And, um. You know, I just think it's unfortunate, bro, that um that he would have to go through something like this, dude. You know what I'm saying? Jameis Winston threw for over, excuse me, it's getting hot in here. Jameis Winston threw for over five five thousand yards last season, bro. He threw thirty interceptions, thirty touchdowns. But you got guys like Sam Darnold that's in the league who's garbage. All right. Some people think Baker Mayfield garbage. I think it was just a product of, you know, Freddie Kitchens not being able to coach. I mean, you got a lot of bad quarterbacks in the league that's getting chance to the chance. Ryan Tannehill, he a bus driver. You put Jameis in a Tennessee and give him Derrick Henry under that situation, Jameis can make five to ten good throws a game like Ryan Tannehill without turning the ball over. Tampa was not the greatest place for him. They didn't have no running game. They was all about throwing the ball around. You put him somewhere in a controlled environment like Tennessee, he can ball. Ryan Fitzpatrick still out here getting the check. Drew Brees can't throw over 20 yards. Somehow he's still getting a check. Ben Roethlisberger can't stay healthy. He passed his expiration date. He's still getting a check. Jared Goff, garbage. You know what I'm saying? You can go on and on and on and on again. Jameis is still learning. Jameis should have a job. Jameis should be starting in the league. It's, it's quarterback state. He shouldn't even be starting, bro. Uh, Gardner Minshew, you know what I'm saying? He all right, but he ain't no real starter. You're looking at Andy Dalton. He ain't no real starter in the league. Ryan, uh, Ryan Tannehill ain't no starter. We know New England don't want no Negro quarterback. Jordan Stenham loved him coming out of college. Not sure he a starter, but I believe they tanking for Trevor Lawrence in New England. So I understand. Derek Carr, Mariota, how they getting chances again? They uh, Well, Mariota getting a chance again. And Derek Carr, he sucks. You can go on and on again. You know what I'm saying? Tyrod Taylor, a good quarterback. You know, maybe Jamison and Tyrod should compete in Los Angeles with the Chargers. You can go through the NFC. Kyler Murray, he's solid. Russell Wilson is the best quarterback in the NFC, in my opinion. You know, golf is garbage. Jimmy Garoppolo, he going to be there. You ain't nothing you going to do about it. He just went to Super Bowl. You can't boot him. You know, Carson Wentz, you know, they need a backup quarterback. He ain't going to do nothing but get hurt. Why not put Jameis? Dak, he good. You know what I'm saying? Washington, Dwayne Haskins, um, you know, they got a Kyle, Kyler, Kyle Allen guy. You go through, uh, um, what is it, New York. I like Daniel Jones. Atlanta, they can use a backup to push Matt Ryan, but they're paying him all that money. Matt Ryan is garbage. You know, Teddy Bridgewater, I ain't really a believer in him, but hey, they believe in him. They still got Will Greer behind him as well, too. New Orleans, they can use a backup quarterback, but they believe in Taysom Hill. That's cool. Um, who else we got? Carolina, Tampa, New Orleans. Uh, it's another team up in the uh, AFC South. I don't know. I always forget that fourth team in the AFC South, but hey, whoever it is. As was it Carolina, Atlanta, New Orleans, and it's another one of them teams down there, man. Uh, can't remember who the freak it is. But you go to the NFC Lions, they married to Matthew Stafford. The Vikings, they just paid uh, old boy a lot of money. Kirk Cousins, he garbage. Shout out to Michigan State, garbage sub too. Aaron Rodgers, garbage. They just got uh, Nick Poles in Chicago. So, um, you know, it is what it is. You know, it's play Tampa Bay, obviously, is the other team in the uh, AFC South. I know I forgot them. But he ain't going back there to back up no Tom Brady. So, you know, it is what it is. He kept it 100. Um, or he gave a politically correct answer. So, shout out to Jameis for being politically correct, man. Uh, and not being ignorant on racist Fox News. So, we know how they is. But, you know, hopefully he get back somewhere. He get the chance to show he can do some things. There's some good spots for him. Pittsburgh, Cincinnati, 
Um, you know, back up Tannehill in Tennessee. I don't believe in Tannehill. Uh, the Raiders should use him, cut Derek Carr, and bring Jameis in. He better than Derek Carr. So we'll see what happens for, for Jameis. But, you know, Jameis, he got the, the situation with the Uber, the crab legs, and he just married his high school sweetheart, so maybe it, it'll calm him down. But Ben Roethlisberger allegedly did a lot of things his college career and pro career. He did the same thing over and over again. But when you black, you already got two strikes against you. So you get another strike, they're going to hold it against you. So Jameis, you got to just continue to rebuild his character, uh, turn get down the turn uh, – cut down the turnovers he got lasik eye surgery so hopefully that helped and we'll see sometimes the change of scenery help it helped uh ryan Tannehill, so i'm pretty sure it could help Jameis. i like Jameis in pittsburgh man hopefully they can make that happen one time for the one time good fellow sports tv don't forget me on facebook instagram twitter reach out there uh to social media if you got business question cry response if you request want to make a donation cash out paypal to the description all my motor city sports talk people who follow my detroit page motor city sports talk check it out it's back up and running i got it back this morning so Everybody been emailing me. I've been trying to build the page back up. Had to go through a few things, delete some videos, and uh, get back into the monetization program over there. So we back. I'll be doing some things later on Motor City Sports Talk. Maybe a big live stream. I'll do it today. So um, so I got all my platforms back. You know, I was uh, hijacked. My channel, this high channel was hijacked. That channel got hijacked. Um, so I got everything back and rolling. So hopefully you support me over there, Motor City Sports Talk. Hopefully you hit the subscribe button. Follow us over here, NBA, NFL, Music Entertainment. We got a lot of playlists, Hood Series, Retro Hoop Series. Check us out. I'll be doing some Forgotten Fighters uh, pretty soon for the boxing. Um, so check us out, man. But I'm back over there. Uh, I got two podcast platforms for this channel, that channel. I'll be working on. I'm working on some things there. Um, so, you know, I got backup channels. So check out Goodfellas Sports TV 2.0. And I'll be doing some great things over there that will be different from this channel. So make sure you sub so you can be a part of that. When I start that up and running, one time for the one time we go.